Hello, and welcome to Insurrection, a uh, Thief 2 uh, fair mission by Hitbreaker, Jeremy Cattle, uh, about an invasion of the undead. Now, this has a briefing video. The briefing video doesn't introduce the mission, uh, so instead I will quickly read out the text from the readme. Lately, the undead have risen out of their graves and massed what seems to be an organized army, and are taking over the city. This can be a problem for you, because what is the point of stealing when everyone is dead? So a local lord, Leonard Kraft, has gotten hold of an antidote for when anyone gets bitten by an undead. You figure that this would come in handy and it is worth a lot, considering he is only selling them to the highest bidders. You also hear that a scientist discovering the reason behind, uh, scientist discovered the reason behind the invasion, and that it may have to do with the recent comet that almost hit Earth. Starting in the almost overrun city, find out what you can, and get what you need. The nearly abandoned city, either dead or running, could use your help, but in turn, you need them to live as well. Stop this insurrection, and make a profit while you're at it. But yeah, you wouldn't be garish if you weren't trying to make a profit from it. Right, new game. I'll uh, pick the difficulty on the objective screen rather than the uh, Jeremy Catlin Hitbreaker presents. A Thief Do the Metal Age fan mission. Insurrection. Special thanks to Drew Bricker and Kenny Lorenzo for the music. Vigil, Nameless Voice, Yandros and Targa for textures and objects. Adrian Smith for menu artwork. Base testers, Yandros, AutoJ55, Silent Warrior and Speech. And especially Slugs, for if not for him this mission would have never started. Your adventure begins now. Right, uh, normal difficulty, find a way to get inside Lord Leonard Craft's estate. The antidote is one of Leonard's most prized possessions. Get the biggest one you can find, most likely in his vault. While you're in the area, might as well pick up some loot. 1300, sounds good. Once finished, return to where you started. All right, what happens if we put the difficulty up? Hard. We get an extra objective. It is rumored that a scientist discovered the true meaning of the undead invasion on the city. Find the scientist and the true meaning behind the invasion. And the loot total's got up to 1750. What about expert? Uh, you're an expert. These do not kill anyone. I assume undead don't matter. And the loot total's got up to 2100. That's quite a lot more. Um, I'm going to go for hard, as usual. Uh, partly because then I don't have to find so much loot just to finish the mission. Uh, but also partly because, you know, if I get in a pinch, I do like to be able to pull out my sword, uh, or bow, and, you know, hack away at the people hacking away at me. So, you know, not going to kill random civilians, but I will kill guards if I can't get away from them and they're trying to get me. If there are any guards, maybe everybody's undead, I don't know. Let's find out. Right. Quick save to start. Let's check the map. Uh, I guess this is where we are. Drop out the window here. Craft Estate is to the north. It's a graveyard. There's lots of guards. It's uh, not full of the observatory. I guess the scientist would be in this observatory. Uh, the house the southeast gate is locked. Uh, we also have a map of the mansion. He's got a music room. It's a huge music room. You must love music. Uh, chapel, library, dining area. Passage to somewhere. Barracks and another library and office Some balconies more questions right so someone sketched out a rough map at uh, for us 
but they don't really know the mansion particularly well, I guess. So we gotta head north to get there. Ah, where's my compass? Let me just check my controls. That's a 12. Okay. Ooh, they've got a custom compass in this mission. So, the undead are apparently roaming the city. Uh, so that's the window I dropped out of. What happens if I climb back up there? Do I have any rope arrows? I do. Surely there's nothing there, right? But I gotta check. Just for curiosity, see if there's nothing else. <laughs> Wait. What? Arrow balls, there's no real wood. There's a... There's a fake... Arrow eating wood. No, I've lost, I've lost one of my two rope arrows. Oh well. I should have checked. I should have tested the uh, arrows first. I don't see any undead here. I see statues. Randomly on the street. So obviously you look around for doors and windows and things that are open. So that we can find any loot, if there's any loot. There's nothing. There was, there's a balcony up there. Or a bridge, but I don't really see a way to get up there. It's all stone. It's all too high to climb. Hmm. Sounds like a drunk guard. Definitely a drunk guard. Is that Benny? Is that you? More statues. Well, I don't really blame you. If the undead were invading my city, I'd probably just get drunk and wait to die as well. The question is, is he going to be friendly? Are you capable of hitting me with the sword or not? I'm just not going to take the chances. You can <coughs> sleep. I hear some other footsteps. It's another guard. That was uh, lucky timing. Someone else there too. Oh, there's another balcony, but again, I don't think I can get up there. So it's really dark. It seems a lot darker than uh, normal missions. Once again, you can probably see better on the stream than I can. Because I've got a filter that puts the brightness up a bit. Uh, but I've got the lights in the room off here and everything is really, really black. Right, you, sir. Well, you know, I'll leave you alive, <laughs> awake. Whatever. If I can break into that door, I can knock the boards off. Hmm. So, do yes, it is. You didn't hear me. You will hear me if I hack those boards off. Oh, here he comes back again. Now, that's. I need to go that way to get to the mansion, but I kind of want to see what is to the southeast here. First, so I know what the you know, get the lay of the land. There's no shadows over there. I'll have to wait till he comes back. Is there anything in the uh, in among the plants here that I missed? Moss arrows, perhaps? No, doesn't seem to be. There is someone else also down that way, I'm pretty sure. I heard some footsteps and whistling. Yeah, definitely footsteps. Ah, he's turned around. Door doesn't open. Door does open. What do we got here? More plants. And what's that? Gems hiding in among the plants. That's nice for me. 
What's that glowing green sword he's got? I hope that's just a lighting glitch, not some kind of magical sort of doom. Back is that way. <laughs> yeah. Nope, and there's no shadow. Come on, No, there's nothing here, sir. I'm suspicious now. It's bad for me. <laughs> he gave up just as though he would have taken one step closer. Okay, then. You know, not, not going to complain about that. What is with that gentleman's sword? That, is that just the light? Maybe it's an ordinary sword and it's just a green light. Oh, there's a ladder up to a ledge. Or actually to a window, I think. I'm not sure where these guys will see me up there. It's quite bright. Oh, he's looking the other way. Some notice there. Ah. Well, he does turn around. Looks like a metal bridge is on, so that's... Uh, <clears throat> you saw nothing there, sir. It's just black here. You have not noticed that your guard friend has stopped walking. See? You saw nothing. Closed due to Armageddon. Well, that's not a bad reason to close. This place is locked. Let's do something about that. Wait, where's my lockpicks? Oh, there's, there's some reason the uh, shortcuts are messed up. So, although apparently the undead are roaming everywhere, I've not seen any. Well, that might be one there. And there. Hmm. Are they dead or are they undead? Who can tell, really? More importantly, do they have any loot? <laughs> I don't want to go too close to them because if they are undead. That will wake them up, but I'm not hearing zombie noises. God, I can barely see anything. I'm gonna have to tweak the gamma here because I can't see. I should put it up a little. Well, there. Well, I can still barely see, but slightly better than before. Got some sacks in the corner, another statue. Oh, money. That's, that's fine. And some deer. It was an undead deer? I don't know. Now. Red. And some apples. Are they dead? Are they undead? They're not reacting to sound. Well, oh, they appear to be actually be dead. Okay. So my careful creeping is uh, probably not needed. Oh, there's a light switch. Alright, one of them. One of them is... Uh, One of them's undead, that's for sure. Saw the light, but didn't see me. Apparently. <laughs> Let's try and get out of here while they still haven't seen me. Yeah, turning the light on was a stupid idea. Alright, we've met our first zombie here, and uh... It did not meet us. It's good news for us. I if I can get on the roof up here. Which way is our friend facing? This 
way. Three three turns. There we are. Right, so it could swim past and there's uh <laughs> there's another body in the river. Oh, he's got a some money on him. I'll take that. I hear another zombie. Well, I'll just put him here in the dark. He should be pretty safe from zombies there. They won't see him. Yeah, they're very blind. Let's see what we've got. Wow. Yeah. Good thing that gets closed, huh? Quarantined entire cell. Eastern residents of the city. I'm afraid the quarantine didn't save anybody. It looks like it's kind of the opposite. Well, I'm, we're not going to go there. That's all thoroughly closed off. And I still have to watch out for this archer patrolling, but I'm going to try and get up to this window before he comes. Ah, uh, cobwebs. Great. And somebody. Dramatically dead in the center of the uh, floor. I wonder if there's a zombie, and if they stand up, if they'll have the uh, sword still stuck in the back. That would be amusing. All right, we've got a banner with nothing behind it, as usual. Self Defense Volume 2. Well, I guess it worked. Whoever was reading it, assuming it wasn't this guy. If it was this guy, then uh, I definitely didn't help him. Lamp, I don't want to turn the lights on. I'm just going to leave him alone. I don't know if he's alive or dead, but, uh, or rather, dead or undead. But I don't think I need to find out. Where is it's very dark. Or oh, soft footsteps. Somebody walking in the next room. Is there anything over here? I actually get there to find out. Seems I can't jump over it. Alright, let's see who's, just, who's walking around here. Ah, oh, zombie in a cage. And a uh, civilian. Maybe he'll be friendly. Let's find out. Hello, Excuse Gizzo. me, sir. My wife is very ill, as you can see. I don't imagine you have the antidote on you, do you? No. We simply cannot afford one. Her time has passed, but while restraining her, she got a good scratch in my neck, as you can tell. I can't really think clearly, and I just crave raw flesh. I sure will miss Sparky. He was a good dog, and surprisingly tender. Mm, sweet, sweet flesh. You're disturbing me, sir. Think. You're about to become a zombie. I don't know, maybe I could get an antidote and bring it to you, but uh, I imagine it would be too late by the time we come back with the antidote. And you were giving me the impression you were just about to uh, turn on me there, so I was just going for some self defense. I'm going to use a kiss of emergency, okay? Alright, uh, I, I might have missed another cutscene uh, of, um, or another bit of dialogue if I've brought him an antidote. I will never know. What do you think I am, a humanitarian? I'm a thief. Even when everything's uh, going to hell in a handbasket, I am still needing to get loot. Go up the ladder. In the dark, where's that archer? Oh, the lighting is all over the place here. It looks no darker. It looks no lighter here than two steps back. Two steps back, I was very brightly lit. And here I'm pitch black. I'm supposed to be able to use. Uh... Oops. Light up. I can't stand that, okay. Should be able to use the levels of light on the ground as an indication, but uh, apparently not. Alright. 
user, we need to protect the city against these vile creatures. This must be a pirate establishment. He's gonna come back and walk off that way, and then I'm gonna attack this door just to see if I can break through those boards. Uh, this door that's behind, behind the wall here. That one. There's another guard there. These guards seem surprisingly calm for the, uh, considering the state of the city. Alright. This is pretty noisy, so. Save us both some uh, trouble. I just kind of feel like there might be a zombie invasion later. All the chances are, and he'll be a zombie. Never should have gotten out of noble guard duty. Nope, he never should. Oh, now it's locked, but it can be unlocked. Just too bright there. Wait for him to come back. And when he goes back to hand, I'll be good. You never suspected a thing, despite mm, he, not uh, again. Nothing. The wind and zombies. Okay. Garrett. Opening doors into his face. Right. A bunch more bodies on the floor. And a doorknob. And there's a uh, fan blowing out there. Once again, I don't know which ones are undead and which ones are near the corpses. And don't really wish to try my luck, but uh, I might have to. He seems to be a corpse. Get out of the way. Yep, there's some valuable bottles, at least two. Now, well, this is the local pub, I guess. They uh, had a pretty good dust up in here before they uh, all died. Very well. I passed better on that side. Let's see what's through here. It looks pitch black and it's not. Sounds like ghosts. Hmm. It's so dark. What's that? Oh, zombie head. Nice. Squish. Oh, zombie torso. Well, uh, I guess this guy died fighting a zombies, but, uh, but he chopped one up before. Oh, we can't get past there, why not? Nobody heard that, did they? Also, where are we on the map? Uh, we're just around here, I guess. Wait, no, we're in this building here. Yeah, we haven't gone there yet. So dark. Carrot has not been eating his carrots. Oh, I'm gonna do a light up with him too. Great. I wonder if I can backstab him. Try when he comes back. Oh, he goes around in a circle. Okay. Hmm? <laughs> 
Yes, backstab works. I'm lucky for me this guy on the floor wasn't the zombie. Alright, do you have electric lights? When I mean, you have electric lights, do you have light switches? You have weird pillars right by the wall. I suppose I could hide behind them if I wanted to. Do you have any loot? Well, a locked chest. That's loot like. A very thoroughly locked chest. Oh, yeah, and some gold in there. I guess that's uh, a good reason to lock it up tight. 274. What's our objective? 1,750. Wow. I do hope the uh, rich guy whose place we're going to rob has lots of money. Yeah. Window doesn't open, but it does give lots of light. Speaking of lights. Do you have an electric light switch? Okay. Oh, that helps me uh, find any more loot. You don't have anything, do you, sir? No. No. At least you won't get a big power bill. I'll turn that off for you. Can't get it from there. I don't want me to be behind them, but it's like tripping them down, you know? It's just so satisfying. Alright, uh, that seems to be all for this building. Now again, I don't know if any of you are zombies except this one. Come on, let's see if I can get the bullseye. Yes. Got okay, the master of uh, bow and arrow at uh, point blank range. What is our friend? You better watch out. He uh, knows you've been slapping off. God, there's nowhere to hide. And this guy's going to patrol from the other side, and there's a guard that comes the other way. That would be a bad place to get stuck between two guards. So I think it is time for our archer friend here to take a little nap, but we... Also, what have I seen there? I guess he's seen the, uh, not seen me, he must be seeing the zombie wandering in the graveyard. There's quite definitely zombies in the graveyard. Another tavern there. Where does he go? Uh, on the map, not objectives. Lots of guards, indeed. <laughs> Ghosts and zombies. What we got here? Another boarded up doorway. Let's see if we can unboard it without attracting too much attention. Darkness there, that's weird. Very weird. There he comes. This job makes me chubby. There's an archer up there, too. Up on the top, you should be aware of him. And boarded up there. Trying to be very thorough here. Oh, I've got a gas mine. That's, that's not going to be any use against the undead. I guess the living. So 
Garrett, why are you always having doors into your own face? Hmm, this gets me through the graveyard. Do I want to be here? I'm not sure that I do, you know? I get the feeling that's the source of the problem and I might have to go there later. I don't think I need to hurry the thing anything along. Oop, let's have a car for him. Where's, where's some darkness? Come on. I'm going to go visit our uh, astronomer friend and the mansion. Right. Um, yeah, let's go visit the scientist friend first to see why this thing is happening. Is that an accessible sewer? It is. There's clearly more undead in the sewer. Great. Whoa! Doors and footsteps. Somebody nearby. A mechanist uh, place here. Living quarters. They have a nice fancy rug as a doormat. That's uh, pretty neat. Yeah, there's a girl up there. Hmm. How do I get in there without uh, being spotted? I'm not wrong when they say lots of guards. I hear them everywhere. Waiting for this one to come walking back down the street. Across the street behind him. Oh, comes here, but. Oh, he saw me! Oh, this must be where the scientist lives. It looks scientific. Enormous astronomical clock. Sir! You're looking the wrong way. Would you mind looking the other way? <laughs> hmm? Hello? Was nothing. Just the wind. Mm, nothing, I guess. Oh well. Yeah, guards everywhere. Oh, someone comes back here as well. That's uh, okay. Good thing I. Hello. Ah, he does turn. After I crawled all the way around here to nothing on the head. Come on, turn around again. I don't want to crawl back over that junk. I only did it so I could get behind you and then you turned around. Very thoughtless of you. Take a break. Can't really see any way up there except through this guard, so I'm gonna have to knock him on the head. Did, you, did I see a key on this place there? Hmm. Oh. Thank you. If we come here to this little. <coughs> Boxes. Locked, of course. No lock picks. Locked and it's very bright. And it needs a key. Do you have a key, sir? No, you didn't. Don't think you did. So, how am I supposed to get in to the observatory? Honestly. Keep sneaking. We'll just get these people out of our way. I think I should get them out of the way. Too many of you. You can join your friend here. These boxes are very comfy. Right. Guess I go ahead to the estate then and worry about the uh, astronomer afterwards. Still have one rip arrow. I should save in case I miss this shot and break it. Hey, is anyone there? Hmm. Not quite right. <clears throat> Good dear. Brightness is all over the shop again. I'm just getting away. Quick, get out, quick. <gasps> oh. Hello? Are you coming back already? Anyway, quick then. 
Don't see me here. You did not. Safer. Where are we? Maybe this is also a way into the census. Now this is a mechanism building apparently, but there's not mechanism guards. It's interesting. Oh, that door doesn't even open, okay. It was just a guard standing watch over stuff. There's someone else in the building here. So yeah, we're up here, so that must be the way the craft is craft estate. Somewhere to the north. Any more guards around? Well there's one in that building, and oh, he's looking out this direction. Where's that door? Maybe it's inside. I'm also seeing a balcony up there that I haven't been to that might have stuff. Let's see if I can open this door. Do it without being spotted. Hopefully he's blind. And oh. asleep. <laughs> yeah, I get there. I understand why you'd have so many guards when there's uh, zombies everywhere, but uh, really, it's not convenient for me. It's open. Oh. Hello there, sir. I don't know if he's only as suspicious or whether he's just, uh, whether the big gear here may, uh, blocked him and he's just walking. No, he saw something. He's just not sure what it was. So I do see, yeah, there's a balcony there. I'm not quite sure how you'd reach it. Maybe from inside. Did I go in that building? Yeah, that was, the, that was kind of the pub building, wasn't it? Maybe I didn't go out on the balcony and I could have. That's worth checking. At any rate, there's a lot fewer guards around now, so if I get down to street level, I might be better able to find my way to this, uh, <laughs> oops, Lord Craftworks escape, uh, estate. Should be clear down at street level. Um, can I go in there? Oh, it doesn't open. Yeah, I did go in here. No, I didn't go in here. Still locked. Now, now the guards' footsteps are uh, silent, so looking here is undead murmuring in my ear, and it's a bit creepy. Station. Creepy red light and very noisy floors. Bought some loot. We're up to 300 out of 1750 total we need to get. That's uh, not doing too well. God, it's noisy everywhere. Oh, right, there's a carpet bit in the middle here. Noisy everywhere except the bit I was avoiding. Well, this is all my fault. What about? Sword. Nobody seems to be hearing me. Drop down, hey, every banner. No banner can me be allowed to live. It's a guard. Somebody's sleeping. Doomsday note. I knew this day would come. No one believed me. They called me a foul barrack, they did. For years, I knew the undead would one day take over the city. It was only a matter of time. Some say the comet in the sky that nearly missed us. Why? Some say they just got smarter. I hear a local scientist got locked away from discovering the truth and is sentenced to death because of it. If this is true, then the world is truly doomed and the apocalypse is now. Repent. 
But if I repented, I'd have to stop collecting loot. You no, know, that's not gonna work. Are you... Well, you look like a civilian, so... I shouldn't have... You don't have a weapon. I shouldn't have to worry about if you wake up. So, I'll just... You know... Do you have any loot on you? Don't appear there. I'll just let you sleep, you know? Sleep through the apocalypse. Oh, there's money here. I'll take that. Nice. 427. Okay, we're getting closer. Sleep well, sir. Oh, there's a light switch. But I will leave the lights off. I didn't want to disturb his slumber. Softly on the metal floor so as not to wake him. Okay, I could check the sewers. But again, I don't think it makes sense. There's the living quarters of these mechanists. Does this door open? No, it does not, so that's not the place I could go. There's that girl up there still. But, uh. There's no doors except uh, the one on the front that doesn't open. Open window? No, it's just a window with no light. I could potentially, uh, oh, banner. Cut down the evil science banners of science. I climb up there, maybe. Oh, this doesn't open. Let me just double check again on that. Because it was a bit hasty before, but no. It will need a key. Uh. Yeah, so this door doesn't open. So, I'm not going to be able to get in there now. And this would be the way to the guy's estate, but it's a wall that's kind of impossible to get over, a spiky fence. Yeah, unless, well, unless that is his estate, but uh, doesn't seem to be a mansion. Now what? Can we explore the sewers or the graveyard? But neither of them seem like a likely place for them to keep the scientist guy prisoner. Up there might be likely, but uh, I don't know how to get in. Let me just go back up here again. Let's see if there's a door that I can open there next. <laughs> Definitely doesn't open. So that's the guy's estate that I need to get to. How do I get there? This door doesn't open. This one does, but it doesn't get me anywhere except spotted by the guard. I can get on the roof, maybe. He's, he doesn't have a bow and arrow, he can't do anything to me. Oops. See if I could stand on that and then onto the roof. Did I, did I, did I not see some crates nearby? Oh, there are a bunch down there. Yeah, we've got some crates. Let's try stacking some crates. Not you. Stacking bodies doesn't help me. Thief, not a you know, corpse collector. Alright, where's my rope again? One of these days I'm gonna miss that and break my last rope arrow and not save it beforehand, and I will be very sad. <laughs> oh, look at that, I balanced it super well with the super weird physics of the thief. Easy way. No uh, special box stacking skills required. I've only got three. Am I 
back up. Carrot, come on, jump up there. Alright. <laughs> Alright, I guess I'm not supposed to be up here because it's not really high enough to stand properly. So I could maybe get over to the estate this way. Definitely can. There seems to be a fence. Does the fence stop? Is there a gap in the fence? No, it doesn't look like there is. It's very hard to see. I'm pretty sure this is not the way I'm supposed to go to get there. So, let's see if I can find the right way. I can at least scout a bit here. I mean, I was definitely, you know, able to climb on this roof. Maybe able to climb on that roof, but uh, how am I supposed to get there? This is this is weird. How many uh, broadheads do I have? Lots. Let's give this gentleman a surprise, shall we? Yeah, you can tell I'm not supposed to be up here. It's not the sound is not proper getting up here. They haven't made rooms. Ah, shake your fist. What if I jump over there and say hello to you? What will you do then? Oh, he wants to fight me. As soon as I find you, you're dead. <laughs> I guess maybe the sewers is my way through then. Because you. come back. Why? Mechanist. Right. Do as it is. Is there a ladder? There is a ladder. Yeah, there's uh, undead down here as well, and it's bright. Combination I don't like. Let's see how far away he patrols. Plus, I'm still hearing all the sounds from the graveyard. Here he comes back. I think there's only the one just here. Yeah. He's going away now. Let's try to get quiet. Alright. That door doesn't open. I have to try another backstab and hope he doesn't uh, hear me splashing up to him. Oh, nice. There's uh, somebody got buried in the ceiling. Yeah, Alright, so he just goes in and out of that. I don't want to know about the spiders. Oh, it's not sewers. Well, it's a combination sewers and catacombs. I guess that's uh, a good way to uh, save space. <laughs> And uh, rats. Oh, he's not dead. I thought you were dead, sir. Ouch. That'll teach me to pay attention. <laughs> Why is that a fire arrow in the fire? It might be. Yep. I don't know if that's an actual zombie or just a corpse. I had spiders before and I don't like that. Take any number of undead and over the spiders. Alright, I think I had a healing potion too. I might as well drink that now. Ah, oh, blissful silence. Spiders are probably up there now. That is a zombie. And he's got me trapped. And he's killing me. Oh, that's no good. Uh, oh, where am I? Right, let's go the other way. So, there's some loot behind him, and I want it. But he's kind of in the way. 
let's just be quick. Yeah, the spiders behind here, are they? Ah, oh, here he comes. You can find me. Yeah, yeah, alright, alright. Oh, I got three fire arrows. Take this! Anyone hear that? There's gonna be spiders behind there. Or just more zombies. I don't even know if this gets me where I'm going. Does it take me north? Not really. There's more spiders. So, uh, again, zombies with no place to hide is not great if they're actual zombies. Well, maybe they're not. They are, and they just don't like the sound of people turning doorknobs. Well, they don't have any equipment to take down three. God damn it, it needs a key. I don't have a key. What am I going to do with you all? Where to now? I need a key and I don't have a key. Oh! I see the spider. Ew, shut up. Well, the zombies aren't going to find me here, so I can take my time, I think, dealing with this disgusting beast. Yeah. That seems to be the only spider, I can't hear any more. Yeah, so close. If I say I can't hear anymore, I can hear something now. Might be in the graveyard. Oh, this is a hammer's place. Hammer at catacombs. You know, if they uh, had got into like dismembering the dead or burning cremating them or something instead of just burying them alive in catacombs, this whole situation might not have happened, you know? There's always catacombs where the hamlets are involved. Ah, oh, not another one of you. Take the loot though, you know, 500 out of 1750. You're not gonna notice me going behind you here, are you? Alright. Oh dear, there's more undead that way though. You saw nothing. Uh, are we back in the graveyard again? I think we might be. Yeah. At least I get a free backstab here. I think he's gonna let everyone else within crowds out. Or maybe not. Oh, he has a sewer key. Well, that's the key I need. I still wanna kill him anyway, you know. Yeah, I'll do it. I'll waste another one there. I want to be able to stand in the dark and see what I'm up to. I mean, he's just still standing there, groaning to to himself. Alright, he's no problem. Okay, so... Past the disgusting dead spider. Shut the door behind me. And then we have our room with our three zombified friends, but now we should have to let us get past them. So I guess I'm just going to run past them. I don't really see any other real options here. 
Well, I'll try and run past him. Oh, well, I went back to sleep again, did he? Alright. Well, that door's locked. They shouldn't be able to get through. Where are we now? Is that rats or spiders are here? Well, that's definitely rats, the high pitched squeaking. Some kind of scurrying noises, though. Bits of wood. Where is your friend? Weird light propagation all over the map. Alright, can I pick this one or do it? It's not the same key. Alright, pick it. Aha! I believe we are in the grounds of the estate. It's been pretty firmly uh, sealed off from the street by that wall. So perhaps there are no undead here. Seems unlikely though. On the other hand, if he has an antidote. Oh, there's a there's half corpse there. If he has an antidote, uh, then that's another reason there might not be any undead. What's this? Aha! Secret entrance to the chapel. Right, here we are, just about to enter Lord Craft's estate. This seems like a perfect place for me to take a pretty short break to make a cup of tea. So I will see you here uh, for the next episode very shortly.